what's up? So right now I am an hour away from Barcelona up in the mountains with this beautiful landscape view. Tomorrow I'm visiting the Sosa ingredients factory where they produce all of their products and they have everything, almost everything. They have fruit pectin, fruit pastes, nut paste, the raw nuts, candy nuts, roasted nuts in all kinds of versions and they have their famous texturizers and stabilizers and um, there is some kind of curiousness behind this brand and this company and I I'm really curious to check out what's behind the scenes so in this episode we're going behind the scenes at the Sosa factory in Barcelona So right now we're in the warehouse of Sosa. This place is huge. Mm -hmm. Some molds from Pavoni. There we are. My favorite sea phones ever. It's like the best, best brand. I'm just gonna talk a little bit quick about the tour that we have in the factory of Sosa. We actually got a tour from uh, one of the family members of the real Sosa family. And I appreciate it so much to know more about the philosophy, about the whole company, and I'm impressed. I always been a little bit curious about this company. Um, a little bit scared to use them, a little bit scared to talk about using them. But after seeing this factory and after meeting the family of the founders of this company and getting their philosophy these guys are insane to be honest these guys are good guys this brand is actually made for getting the most out of flavors to expand flavors to to increase flavors to the next level and uh, that for me is something really important when you're cooking because you always want it to taste better, to taste more. So I'm gonna tell you one little secret about the factory. I wasn't allowed to film in there, but I can tell you some short details. So there is these, they have these candied fruits that are like eight centimeters long. There is a person, a human being cutting those by hand and everything that's dried on like big trays, they're placed, not by machines, by hand. And I think that is pretty insane. To have one person cutting all of those orange peels and then placing them on a tray, put them into the dehydrator or whatever. But it is a human being cutting those. And I saw it. That for me is pretty sick for a big brand and a big factory like the Sosa products. I just told the guys that I'd be down in 15 minutes, 20 minutes ago. So I should get going. Um, you know, thank you so much for watching the second episode of my vlog channel. Make sure to subscribe, subscribe to the Instagram, leave me a comment, hit some likes, and I'll see you soon.